Hello guys, welcome back to Mr. Legend Crypto. Guys, in this video, we'll be taking a look at an altcoin, Falcoin. Falcoin is currently trading for $8. How high can it go in this relief rally from the all-time high for Falcon that came in on the 29th of March 2021 at $234? Falcon has dumped really hard. It has lost over 97% of its value. Right now, the altcoin market is rallying really hard. Falcon has gone from as low as $5 to as high as eight dollars in this video i will show you resistance level where falcon will need to overcome if we are going to see new all-time highs and how high falcon can go in this relief rally the altcoin market is rallying really hard we've had a green month we've had a green week in the altcoin market should we start buying falcon right now also looking at falcon's performance against bitcoin falcon's performance against ethereum and then we'll be taking a look at falcon's market cap currently falcon has a market cap of two billion dollars at the top of the bull run falcon's market cap was as high as 14 billion dollars will falcon go to new all-time highs in relief rally we'll be talking about that and more in this video but first guys if you're new to this channel and you want to make money trading investing or holding falcon in the long run this is the channel for you don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this turn on the post notification if you want to get notified anytime i drop a new video let's get down to business Guys, at the point of recording this video, we're having a very green week in the altcoin market. Altcoins are pumping really well. We're having a very green month in the altcoin market. Ethereum Classic is up 142%. Socials is up 128%. We have Falcon up 47% in the last one month. But guys, in the last one year, Falcon is down 88.8% and in the last one week is down 3.8% to the million dollar question. How high can Falcon go in this relief rally? Guys, when the crypto bear market and Falcon has been dumping since when it set its all-time high in April 2021, it lost over 97% of its value. And guys, we know that during the bear market, that's exactly what all coins used to do. They used to dump really hard from their all-time high, and most of them dumped from 90 to 99% from their all-time high. Falcon has fulfilled that criteria, it's down 97% from its all-time high, but is the bottom in and how high can falcon go in this relief rally guys the first important level we need falcon to clear for us to take this rally seriously is falcon can clear 17 dollars 17 dollars is a very very pivotal level for falcon you can see right here since when falcon was launched in 2017 17 dollars has been an important level for it we had a relief rally right here in april 2018 falcon got to 17 dollars got rejected off that level and we didn't see 17 dollars till june 2020 when falcon got to 17 dollars in 2020 we consolidated around that level and went to set new all-time highs right now in 2022 we dumped into goblin town but before that what happened falcon consolidated around that 17 dollar region before we started dumping so right now i would expect if falcon continue rallying maybe just maybe we might rally and get to as high as 17 dollars then turn and continue going to goblin town or Consolidate around seventeen dollars again and go to set new all-time highs. Anytime you see this kind of mad crash in all these all coins, you expect some relief rally to come at some point in time. Even using the Fibonacci retracement tool, we know that we're going to get some relief rally. Are we going to get a zero point three eight two relief or a zero point five relief? Or maybe just maybe we'll be lucky to see Falcon go to as high as the zero point seven eight six level, and that means Falcon will go to as high as one hundred and seventy eight dollars. But before we get ahead of ourselves, where's the next resistance level? Falcon will need to clear. If Falcon can comfortably clear $17, I showed you guys how $17 is a very, very pivotal point for Falcon. If we can clear that level, just if we can clear that level, guys, we need to cross the $53 level. In 2017, the highest Falcon got to was the $28 region. That's another very important region. If I zoom out here, you can see that that has been a region where Falcon has been reacting to. Before we went to new all-time highs again in 2020, we consolidated around that $28 region. And right now, in 2022, as we're dumping to Goblin Town, we got rejected of that region in the rally we had in March 2022. The history repeats itself. Will Falcon get rejected of this level? Because guys, where we are right now for Falcon is another important resistance level. That's around the ten dollar level. And will Falcon continue rallying? Because we still have a green month. We still have a green week in the altcoin market. A lot of altcoins are popping really hard. But maybe just maybe Falcon has actually bottomed out, and we might be going to set new all time highs. Guys, if you look at the Falcon RSI, this Falcon's chart on a three day time frame. On the RSI on the three day time frame for Falcon, we showing us that this is the lowest Falcon's RSI has been in history. And most times when the RSI comes to this low region, that has always been a good time to buy. But we got the RSI in this low region here in February 2022, but that was a fake signal. Right now, is this the best time to buy some Falcon? Are we going to see Falcon pump to 16, 23, 53? 
or maybe new all-time highs guys before we look at how falcon is performing against bitcoin and ethereum some technical details about falcon currently falcon is ranked number 33 on coin market cap and falcon currently has a market capitalization of 2.1 billion dollars if you look at the market cap of 2 billion dollars it has circulating supply of 257 million foul tokens guys where can you get some falcon if you want to get some falcon during the bear market this is a very very popular altcoin we have over 342,000 people that have falcons on their watch list you can get falcon on binance get.io coinbase hubo global qcoin coin one and guys anywhere you get your favorite altcoin why would you want to hold falcon through the bear market what makes falcon unique Falcon aims to store data in a decentralized manner. Unlike cloud storage companies like Amazon Web Service or Cloudflare, which are prone to problems of centralization, Falcon leverages its decentralized nature to protect the integrity of the data location, making it easily retrievable and hard to censor. Guys, let's go how Falcon is performing against Bitcoin and against Ethereum. Against Bitcoin, Falcon has been pumping in the last 40 days against Bitcoin. Falcon bottomed right here on the 12th of June 2022. And since then, Falcon has gained too much value against Bitcoin. Falcon is up 130% against Bitcoin in the last 45 days. But will Falcon continue gaining value against Bitcoin? Because guys, in the bear market, we know that all coins lose value against Bitcoin. Falcon included in 2017 when Falcon was launched at the end of the bull run. Falcon gained more than 350% against Bitcoin. But what happened after that? In the corresponding two years, Falcon kept dumping against Bitcoin. At some point in time, Falcon was down more than 90% from its all-time high against Bitcoin. In the 2021 bull run, Falcon rallied itself from September 19 when Falcon was at its low against Bitcoin. It rallied to the high set on the 15th of October 2020. Falcon went up more than 4,100% against Bitcoin. In March 2020, Falcon tried to set new all-time highs and failed in that attempt. It got higher than where we were in 2017. But guys, from where Falcon was in 2021 till where we are right now, Falcon dropped more than 94%. This is why you want to be careful with all coins when the market is tanking. At the same time, that's when you want to accumulate all coins. So during the bear market, when everybody's shouting, everything is going to zero, and Bitcoin is going to 10K, all coins are going to zero, that's when you want to be quietly accumulating all this Falcon so that when we go back to the bull run, when the market is in easy mode, you'll be among the people selling on the top shouting kumbaya guys falcon's performance against ethereum is nothing to write home about since well falcon was run right here it has not had that kind of crazy pumps we always see in all coins against ethereum even though falcon has pumped really well against ethereum it has returned over 735 percent from its launch price against ethereum it's still here to give us that kind of crazy pump we want to see but even the bear market right now falcon has been dumping it double topped right here against ethereum and it had the first top in October 2020, it came back, tried to set new all-time highs in April 2021, and just like the Bitcoin pairing, guys, Falcom is down more than 97% from that high. Falcom has been dumping the last 485 days. We knew that during the bear market, all coins can continue dumping till the end of the next bull run, and that's where they will come out and all of them will start pumping again. So, guys, right now you want to be accumulating a lot of these all coins. Falcom included. You want to be flipping your Bitcoin and you want to be flipping your Ethereum for some Falcom in the bear market. But you don't want to go all in. You want to do it systematically. You want to dollar cost average into it. Looking at Falcom's market cap, Falcom's market cap from October 2020, Falcom's market cap went to an all time high of $14.8 billion. Crazy returns in just 160 days. Falcon market cap went from $400 million to as high as $14.5 billion. But since when Falcon's market cap tops in the 31st of March 2021, it has been setting lower lows and lower highs. It has been dumping since then. From the high in 2021, it came to the lows we set in 17th of June 2022, while Falcon's market cap dropped to as low as $1.1 billion. For Falcon to get to a new all-time high from where we are right now, Falcon will still need to pump another 650% on his market cap chart and if we go to the falcon price chart if falcon props 650 percent are we going to go to new all-time highs no guys we're not going to go to new all-time highs to just carry us to exactly where we were on the 6th of november 2021 you might be wondering why is there discrepancies between falcon's market cap and the price chart is because guys when falcon was pumping to the moon we didn't have all the falcons in circulation right now it looks as if we have 100 percent of the total supply in circulation 
only time we tell how far come we go in this relief rally but these are important levels you want to watch out for as the market is rallying you want to see if falcon can pass ten dollars then sixteen dollars then maybe just maybe we'll get to twenty eight dollars and if we're lucky enough in this relief rally we might see falcon trading for fifty three dollars so guys drop your thoughts in the comment section what will you be doing to falcon during the bear market will you be buying more falcon right now expecting higher prices will you be selling into the pump because you expect lower prices or will you be that hodler that is just going to hold through the chaos till we see new all-time house for falcon in the future thank you for watching this video please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this turn on the post notification if you want to get notified anytime i drop a new video see you guys in my next video Seven.